I'm Nick Boyle. I'm a composer and pianist, and I've been working with Tarnova for maybe seven or eight years, on and off. Initial involvement was um, The Tempest. Um, so uh, that was a large scale production with community and professional actors, singers and dancers. Um, and it was a great opportunity to create very big pieces of music and um, for people from the community to have an experience of working um, with professional musicians, actors, dancers. Um, so it was, an, it was an excellent production um, and I think it um, inspired a number of people to kind of find their place in the arts as well. So it was a very valuable um, piece of work. So there was The Tempest, uh, there was Midsummer Night's Dream, which was another um, sort of uh, project with the community in arts um, and around that area. Um, it was a particularly, I think, enjoyable experience um, because, again, um, there was a real sense of people working together cohesive, cohesively, having a common purpose, and you could see uh, people learning and gaining confidence through the process, um, particularly from my perspective in music where people maybe had a bit of concern about singing or getting involved. Um, you could see their growth and progression from the uh, beginning to the end um, of the piece. So it was quite an impactful piece of work and sort of relationships um, that formed during that work carried on long after it. So, um, so it was that. I've done some of the um, home projects with Terranova, working with uh, emerging artists. Um, that's been great for me uh, personally because you get a kind of insight into other people's artistic process. You learn a lot yourself, challenges your um, own thinking and preconception about things. And it's always a good um, exercise, I think, to collaborate because it helps you define yourself as well. I think in the wider community, um, firstly there's an opportunity for people to have um, their view of the world heard. So there's a real sort of inclusivity there. Everyone's story is important and there's space given for those stories to be told. So people are looked after in the community. So from that um, position of knowing that they're acknowledged in the way they see things um, is acknowledged, I think that's a good foundation um, you know, for people building relationships, finding out about each other. Um, again, being exposed to new ways, different ways of thinking about the world, maybe challenging their own preconceptions and um, really, again, developing um, this sense of common purpose in order to see a project through to the end. There's something about that journey of taking something that's really just a notion, um, going through practical steps, going through creative steps, and then having an event at the end. That's a real um, kind of journey, and it can be um, quite challenging for people but there's always support there. So, um, as I said in the last answer, I think that's demonstrated um, by the sorts of relationships that people uh, maintain long after you know, a particular project itself is over. Yeah, so it is uh, providing um, I suppose it provides a sort of professional 
machinery for um, people to get their message out. Um, you know, people to get their message out concurrently um, and in a artistic way. Um, so I think that's very important in kind of presenting maybe cultures and so forth that people haven't been so exposed to in a theatrical context. So I think that's all um, important work and is very valuable. Yeah, I would just say, you know, uh, theatre groups like Turn of uh, the Arts generally, um, as we were discussing, um, I think deserve to be funded and, um, and respected as doing, I think, important work because exposure to art is exposure uh, to someone's viewpoint, someone's individual way of thinking or a different way of thinking. And that's, that's good, that uh, keeps you adaptable, keeps you flexible. Um, and it's generally good for you, I think so. I think the arts are very important. They should be funded well. They shouldn't be seen as disposable. And um, yeah, so I just, um, just hope the landscape for artists um, becomes more hospitable than maybe it has been for the last while. Three words I think of when I think of Terranova. Big hearted approach. It's more of a slogan.